Okay, choir. So <clears throat> I wanted to get a video to show y'all, talk to y'all about things. You know, nothing bad. So, but um, something that I've been working with. Um, sorry, my Christian reggae playing. So it's like Afro-Cuban stuff. But anyways, <laughs> trying to keep video short. <laughs> Hopefully it is. <laughs> but something I've been working with Starling Bailey is, um, you know, as we discussed with the microphones, you know listen to um like uh was it that that mass choir out of florida the old school one from like the 70s and 80s and all that stuff you know listen to them sing you know granted they probably have a massive sound system and all that jazz a dedicated sound guy to turn you up or down if you're you know getting you know say too loud or too soft or something like like that but um the main thing is what i want to discuss with y'all is dynamic. Think of the song. This is what I've been teaching Starley and Bailey. Oh, sorry, I'm sewing this very beautiful dress and I started wrong sides together. Oops. That's alright, no big deal. So that was chat. But anyways, so the, the dynamic range of where you sit in the mix. You know, as say a choir as a whole or as a single vocalist, you know, as I explained to them, soft songs think. Soft song, soft mood, gentleness, all that jazz. You wanna be soft, not say sing soft, but be soft where you're sitting in the thing. You know, it's cause we're, we're building a mood here. What God wants us to do as the choir as the vocalist, as the musicians. You know, this goes towards, you know, Eugene, me, Mandy, Dino when he practices and plays with us and stuff like that, Starley, Bailey, you know. This is what I've been teaching them. You know, it took me years to figure this out. You know, sometimes, you know, where do you sit in the mix? What kind of style song is it? Is it a gentle song or is it a hard driving song, you know? You could be your lead parts, you know, Amanda's like, hey, your turn, you know, then you can get up on the mic, close, you know, get up on there. But if it's a song that requires all of us vocally to be as one giant unison voice, then you know to back off. But what I want y'all to do is practice. Like, you know, you could practice that at home, but you're not going to know how far away to get off of your mic, you know, in perspective to where we all sit. That takes time. It does. I know. It does. So, but what we want to work on is, man, I had my dress facing the right direction the first time. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. No, my miss. But anyways, practice. Like, say, when we get back together again for another band practice, you know, I'll probably just remind me somebody one of y'all there's like 10 of us <laughs> remind me or eight of us i lost count remind me to you know before you know when we do a general sound check hey we need to figure out where we need to be you know we all know you get on the mic you're going to be loud that we do know but we need to figure out where everyone needs to generally see from, say, perspective from your nose to here. Is it three inches? Is it five inches? Because y'all all have a different gain level. You all have a different vocal range. And if I know the sound was clipping on the audio from the church church this past Sunday. And that was that brand new mic that uh, Harold's been using, per se. You know, it has its own independent gain level. And I kind of had it set pretty good. The first Sunday, but obviously the second Sunday. Now, it was off a little bit. No big deal. Easy fix. Tap a button two, three times. Bam, we're back to where it was on that one. But go back and listen on some of the songs. You know, where we where we, we all came in as one unison. You know, you'll hear there might be a vocal here or there that might have gotten out. Or a vocal here and there that might have got lost. Because we're, we're all learning to work together as a team, you know, work together as what God wants us to be, and we're doing great. So, but yeah, so I want you to start thinking about 
where do you sit in the mix? Like I was telling Starly the other day, soft songs. Is your part to, to be, view it as standing. Is your part, this is the general music. Eugene is our volume level where we ride because we can't control, he can control how loud he needs to be. And a lot of times him and the bass drive the power of the, of the song how hard god's wanting us to like smack people with the song you know so where do you want to be we're going to be is your part like say we'll use starley as, as an example or me as a lead guitarist as as an example <clears throat> and you'll hear it whenever i play too you, you'll notice i'll disappear and fade into the back or it's my part where something's getting emotional i roll into the front and i play harder you know or i have my volume pedal you know, if it's a sound like a distortion sound where I, you can't control the dynamics of some distortions. So, but with Starly Violin Plan, is it, if it's a country song, it's okay. She sits in front of the mix. The mix is us as a unison. You know, but if she's got a solo, say the vocalist is sitting here. All right, well, we're gonna, sorry. Well, that's where I hold it on my thimble. So, vocalist, lead vocalist is sitting right in front of the mix. This is the mix. My ruler. Starly playing. She's got a solo, so she'll roll into the front. Play her solo with the volume pedal, get herself up front, and you can hear it. And then she'll roll back when she's just doing like fills or stuff like that. We gotta think of that with our vocals also. You know, lead vocalist, like say Mandy's singing. So she gets closer on the mic, brings herself forward. So she's singing her to her lead part, or Bailey, like last that one song she did. You know, she's doing her part. Say, um, the other song we did where we were as a giant group, Mandy was up front, then y'all would come in, you know. What song was that? That was, um, Ain't No Great. There we go. That's a good song to listen to on the recording. So, Mandy jumps in, does her lead part, then say it's a, it's a chorus or something, or verse-wise, she's doing her part. But chorus-wise, we want to be be one, so Mandy will back off a little bit, and you become one. So, let's start listening to, well, I know a lot of y'all listen to music, so listen to some of those old school choirs, you know, where they're running older stuff, you know, and stuff like, like that. You can hear it. You'll hear that person come in, but when it's time for all of us to be, 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 be one, they all know their perspective range on their game level. Like, because Misty, she's got a little more sensitive game level than say Carmia or Amanda or Mandy because those three have extremely powerful voices so Misty Alexis and Cheyenne you know they got y'all got choir voices so I have y'all's game level actually hotter than the other three so it just takes practice choir song figure out where we're equal wise how far away to back away normally it's like six inches eight inches no more than 12 inches max. You'll see me back far away off, you know, because I have my mic set up like crazy stupid sen sensitive. So way more sensitive than the rest of y'all's. That's why it clips when I get right on it. So, but I ordered a new mic for my issue that I have. I hate that mic. I don't hate it. It just, it sounds like I'm singing through a tin can. But anyways, we're getting off topic. So when we do get back together, this is what I want everyone to do. We're going to work on it. Figure out where your jump in front of the mix ranges which is normally lips touching the mic or almost touching the mic depending on where i have your gain level set and we can adjust everything to perfection so it gets to the point to where once you learn that then you know where you need to sit for when we're doing our, our part you know yes you can still get into the music get into the song get into where god's leading you you know but yeah, that's what I want to talk about. It's a nine-minute video. Good golly. So I might have to load this to YouTube. Anyways.